Tom Heyer, a boxer and native New Yorker, became the first major sports celebrity in America. Known as Young America, Heyer in 1849 defeated the smaller and lighter Yankee Sullivan, a New Yorker and Irish immigrant. The bout was a watershed event, and not only because it was for the unofficial National Heavyweight Championship. The New York Herald story on the 15-round fight marked the first telegraphic transmission of a major sports event. The Herald had helped create the fight for one primary reason, to sell newspapers. The winner-take-all Hire Sullivan purse was $10,000, $5,000 raised by each fighter through his supporters, at a time when the average laborer in New York earned about $300 a year. Competitive boxing was illegal in the United States, so the fight was held on a small island in Maryland to help keep authorities away. When Hire finally made it home to Manhattan, there were fireworks and mass celebrations in his honor. One giant lit sign displayed for months on a restaurant downtown read simply, Tom Heyer, Champion of America. Heyer never fought again. Instead, he got into politics and managed a drinking establishment near the southeast corner of 44th Street and 5th Avenue. A converted frame house, the place was called Ye Old Willow Cottage, named for the willow tree outside. In 1863, less than a year before Heyer died, the city erupted in a three-day reign of terror known as the New York City Draft Riots. Ye Old Willow Cottage became the rioters' headquarters.